Okay. Welcome. Congratulations. Now you can. Okay, I will sit here. Sit there. We go from the beginning. Okay. So. Uh, I said I was a little bit surprised at this first move. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> just a transposition. Yes, that. yes, yes. Um, okay, let's just uh, advance mm -hmm. a few moves. Yes, of course. D5, D4, Knight F6, C4, C6, Knight C3, E6, and now not Bishop G5. No, not Bishop G5 of course, yeah. of course, E3 and Knight B D7. And this is Mirano variation. Everything, yeah. uh, everything theoretic, very theoretical. Also, very deeply analyzed. B5, Bishop D3, Bishop B7, Castle A6, E4, C5, D5, uh, D5. Yeah. Until here, everything very, very well known. Yeah. Okay. Here there are two moves: Queen C7 and C4. That they usually usually play C4. They okay. They usually transpose anyway. So transpose there is. Yeah. So uh, okay. C4, Bishop C2, Queen C7, and now. And uh, now, of course, after Knight D4, um, Knight C5 is the most uh, normal move. Yes. And okay, here of course there are many options. Uh, but E5. But motives are like in the game: fight against this structure with B4 yeah, and yeah, B4 yeah. and so on. Uh, but E5 is relatively seldom seen. I, I, I really didn't have any detailed knowledge. I just knew that there was one game. Very famous game, uh, Gelfand versus Dreyf, where mm -hmm. Dreyf won. And uh, I think that game went, if I'm not completely mistaken, it went queen f3 in this position. Knight f4, knight takes f7, king f7, g3, g5. Um, and black was more or less okay, I think. This looks better than uh, in, in the game, yeah. which should have had in the game. Yeah, and eventually, uh, I think the reason the game was famous is that eventually white got the, uh, let's just say he played queen h3 and bishop here, and black just played something like, um, sorry, rook g6, and then just played rook g6 after bishop h5 and sacrificed the exchange. Just a little bit louder. Ah, <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, so that's what... Um, uh, but again, maybe it was a slightly different position, but at least that was the theme. Uh, but, but this looks logical to prevent G3, Knight F4. Yeah, it looks very logical. And uh, here I started to like my position, because Bishop C5 is pretty logical. But here, I think after bishop d2, he might be in serious trouble already. Uh, because b5, b4 is a very strong threat. And if he plays queen d6 to prevent this, uh, then I might play b4 anyway. And uh, after bishop takes b4, there is a4. Yes. And if takes, I take with the queen, not allowing b4. b4 yes. White has uh, excellent compensation, at least. So uh, he played bishop d4. He thought for a w very long time here, around here, but he, he probably couldn't find anything good. So b4, I think, maybe surprised him, but uh, I think it's a very strong move. And now if, if he makes some kind of neutral move, let's say knight g7, to prepare F5, I just go A4 A4 is A4 coming, A4 yes, A4 so is coming. And, and it's really, uh, really bad for him. And uh, obviously here, B4, Knight, E2, Bishop takes B4 is unplayable for black. For example, just Bishop B2 and then D6. And it's yes, on F7 is... Yeah, for example, Queen D7. Disaster. Bishop F4. Yes. Uh, so he played queen d6, but now white just has a huge edge because uh, 
he, his king has no This problem is his king. Yeah. The main problem is. Yes, and also my pieces are active. This bishop on b7 is not good. Um, okay, so knight g7. Looking for counterplay with f5. Yes. This is the only way to, to yeah. do something. A4. Okay, of course, if he plays b4, then I go knight e2, and then bishop c5 or something. Then a5 and bishop a4. Next. Yes, of course. Uh, so f5, f it takes knight e2. Here I have the feeling that I, I didn't play particularly precisely. Why? Uh, what could you do be better? Because I, I thought there should be some way to win even quicker here. Maybe bishop a4 here. Ah, instead of taking on a6, you yeah. mean. But then he plays a5 and... Of course you can play to, something like rook c6 yeah. and so on, but... Somehow, I, and here also queen, uh, rook c6 looks very tempting, but he plays queen a3 and I, I, I looked at this for a while and I just decided that it was not worth it. Because yeah. here I might actually, here I actually have, have to find something, otherwise I'm losing material. But these are unnecessary complications. Yes, but here, what, what I, I missed something very simple. I, 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 th I was I was just calculating queen takes h6 here, mm -hmm. and then bishop here, queen h3. But now white wins quite simply with this. And, and if okay, if he c exchanges queens, then it's, it's obviously all over. So he yes. has to take here, and, mm -hmm. and uh, queen takes g4. And yeah, that's all falling apart. Uh, s but I simply forgot that he can take, and and now if rook c6, then bishop takes f2 Check. Mm -hmm. and uh, check and bishop and no, this is and just knight is hanging. Yeah, and uh, okay, I can play knight f5 takes takes, but then. Black has two pawns, and my pieces are a little bit passive, so I didn't didn't like that. And the point of rook c8 is now after king e7, rook c6 is much stronger. Because now if takes, 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 I have this now check. It, yes, the check on the b4, that's yes. the difference. And so he plays bishop d8, and um, yeah, and uh, now. Fortunately for me, his his um, pieces are so badly coordinated that uh, uh, that there's no way to save the game. Uh, so uh, I think after rook takes f5, I would just play queen d3 anyway. And um, now after rook f7, N this one this should be four. Yes, it's just dreadful for black. Yeah. And if rook f6, then knight c3. Comes yes, c3 also comes. knight comes on e4. Yeah. This is a disaster. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so here, after queen d3, he's just losing material, I think. Uh, for example, one nice line is rook b6, bishop a5, rook b8, bishop c7. <laughs> and uh, and like this. Nice tactics. Yes. And... Uh, and otherwise, I cannot see anything for him. So he played rook a7, uh, queen b5. Was this given on uh, my print uh, yes, 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 it yes. was. Okay. Mm -hmm. Queen d7. Obviously, if uh, rook d7, then bishop b4. Four, and I do not take mm -hmm. and play the end game, but rather this and uh, mate. And mate, of course. Yes. And uh, also, of course, if king f7. Just this should be four, yes. So, King d8. Aha! It was like. So, no, no, so no this was analyzed. Yes, yes, yes. And he, uh, he resigned, yes, yes. And he, he played queen d7. He played queen d7. And then mm -hmm. he, he resigned because of queen d8. Yes, king and bishop b4. Yes. Mm -hmm. yep. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Thank you.